welcome back to JD TV. Today we have our last segment in our composite series, which is on panels. And the trend is to get away from plywood. So a lot of the core manufacturers, in the interest of selling more core, have come up with prefabricated, typically four by eight rigid panels. But here's really th what we're talking about. There's three different panels. There's foam core, glass skins with peel ply, very high quality, extremely tight tolerances, expensive panel. But you can make, you know, furniture, bunk tops, um, dock boxes, bait wells, fly bridges. I mean, the list goes on and on and on with this product and with this sort of product. Airx PXC 385. That's a urethane foam board sheet that is created in a closed mold, closed press, and, and chemically they, they control the rise of the foam mm -hmm. to give the product different finish densities. It's, it's, very, it's a very uh, true board and in in it doesn't have um, deflect, deflections, it won't curve, it doesn't warp, it doesn't absorb water. It's, yeah, it's, not, else it's not a cosmetic panel. Nidacore offers a polypropylene, you know, celled product with a fiberglass base also. That's this material. Um, again, excellent sound deadening, lightweight, not quite as stiff as the other two panels. If you were to do a, a span, it wouldn't quite be as stiff, be a little bit more flexible. Well, that wraps things up for composites. Remember, you can find all the composites you've seen in this series at jamestownistributors.com.